I welcome everyone to our YouTube channel AEO Grey Organics. In this video we will see an answer to your doubt that whether I can get seat or not. Before going deep into this video, if you are new to our channel, you can subscribe our channel. Our channel videos will be useful for ICR counseling related videos and other related agriculture education videos. So most of the channel members, channel subscribers and known juniors, friends, everyone is sending their rank card and asking whether I can get seat in any of the university like that. So one happy thing is that we can able to see the good ranks some people got a 10 20 30 even one student got first rank in one subject so like that so it's very happy to see but most of the students this is only some 10 percent student but remaining 80 to 90 percentage students are sending their rank above 600 700 2000 3000 today i have seen one rank as 5000 in one subject so one thing we have to consider here ICER has not yet released seat metrics for the year 2023 both for UG, PG and PhD. So without seat metrics it's very difficult to tell or it's very difficult to predict whether you will get seat or not. But if you are getting some good rank especially with related to uh, subjects such as agronomy or plant science like that if you got some 300-400 rank also there is a chance to get seat. But in most of the subjects it's not possible you have to score the rank at least 150 like that so that is also important here so in this video we will see the seat metrics of 2022 with relate to both pg and phd whereas uh, recently the seat metrics for iri and its hub has been released that one we have given some three to four videos uh, in our previous so you can check that seat matrix in our previous videos that also has been posted in our group so you can go through that one in addition to that uh, every university will give seats that is two to three seats or some universities will give four seats in each department like that so that will vary from year to year so keeping the view of a previous year we cannot judge with the upcoming years but we can be able to analyze one trend so that's one what we can see here so here this is the seat matrix of icr 2022 so we can able to see here that is they have given for the scholarship and some other thing here just we can able to see the total number of the seats so with related to the plant biotechnology it is divided into three one is biochemistry molecular biology and biotechnology and plant physiology so with related to this there are 152 seats but you can see here which one you can get that PG scholarship that is also important so PG scholarship will be around uh, I think so 12,000 amount something that it will be and the NTS will be around 5,000 rupee that exact amount I don't know but if you are getting that PG scholarship earlier it was called by the name JRF now the name JRF is only for PhD not for MSc that one also you have to keep in mind but everyone will use the same word JRF that we can also follow. Next with related to the plant science we can able to see that in previous year there was 484 seats. So this year also it may come around 500 like that but here the good thing is if you are getting ranks such as 600, 650, 700 in plant science also there is a chance to get the seat so that is also important. Next with related to the physical science you see only 143 seats are there around among that 28 seats are scholarship so you have to consider that one next is uh, entomology and nematology there were 176 seats but uh, this year this may increase next with related to agronomy it is 229 seats only but uh, this year this may increase due to some higher hubs and other related aspect so like that you can go through others also even with related to social science there are around 200 seats only so in social science there is no seats in hub i think so so this is also one of the criteria next with related to the horticulture there were only 271 seats in previous year but this year in IIHR there was a there is increase in seat with related to higher hubs so you can get some increased seats so this may be around 300 seats this year so like that you can go through each and every subject someone asked in comment about agriculture engineering and technology in previous year there was only 138 seats this year this may increase or decrease that we don't know next year like that you can go through for each and every subject so from this you can come to a conclusion that if your rank is around or within this you can plus 100 for example if the availability of a seat is 450 if your rank is within 550 you can get the seat so with related to agronomy also if your rank is within 300 or 350 there is a chance to get the seat but after that there is a less chance to get the seat and another one thing you have to keep in mind in many universities such as TNAU and some other universities has already started the classes 
and they have conducted admission they have completed everything the students those who have joined in those universities now if they get seat in icr also they may come or they may not come and the another one criteria is even tnau this year how they have reduced the number of the seats with related to their state entrance so that is also you have to keep in mind so like this the same thing happens in karnataka form universities also and some other universities also so everything by combining this into in our mind we can get one idea what is the trend so similarly there is a brochure for phd also you can go through that one i will send this brochures for 2022 for both pg and phd in our telegram group so you can go through that one this is the trend until and unless the seat matrix has been released we cannot predict anything but this will give one idea so that's the thing why i am sharing here and another one is the subject you, you that you are willing to choose for example in this uh, subjects such as horticulture or any other subject we can consider plant science someone will prefer only for microbiology someone will prefer only for plant pathology if they get seats in breeding also they will not take so like that some people will be there so if they are not willing to take the other subjects it means that seat will become vacant so there is a increased chance for getting the seats those who are in below rank so like this it will happen for many subjects that which are in subject combinations but this may not happen for the subjects such as agronomy let us wait and see what will happen in future thank you